If x is equal to log 12 to the base 24, y is equal to log 24 to the base 36, and z is equal to log 36 to the base 48, then x, y, z plus 1 is equal to. Now we have to obtain the value for x, y, z plus 1. So let us substitute the values for x, y, and z. Now x is log of 12 to the base 24 into y is log of 24 to the base 36 into z is log of 36 to the base 48 plus 1. Now we apply the change of base theorem in these log terms and we obtain log 12 upon log 24 into log 24 upon log 36 into log 36 divided by log 48 plus 1. Log 24 cancels with log 24, log 36 cancels with log 36. And now we have log of 12 upon log of 48 plus 1. Now we equalize this. Okay, here we'll just put the equal to sign. Equalizing the denominator, let's see what we get. We have log of 12 plus log of 48 divided by log of 48. Now log A plus log B is log of A into B. So this becomes log of 12 into 48 divided by log 48. Now 12 times 48 is 576. So we have log of 576 upon log of 48. Now if we look at the options, we have two in each of the terms, right? So if you observe 576, this could be written as log of 24 square upon log of 48. Now we transfer this 2 in the front and see what we get. We get 2 times log 24 upon log 48. Now we need the value in terms of x, y and z. Now we have 24 and 48. So if you see we have 24 in this term that is the y term and 48 is there in the z term and if you observe a common term 36 right we have 36 in both of these terms so what we do here is we multiply and divide by 36 so this could be written as 2 times log 24 upon log 36 into log 36 upon log 48 and we could write these two log terms in a single log form that is log of 24 to the base 36 and this could be written as log of 36 to the base 48 now if you observe log 24 to the base 36 this is equal to y and log 36 to the base 48 is z. So the answer is 2yz. And let's check the option. Yeah, it's option C. So the answer to this question is option C.